Welcome to the Film Room presented by Lincoln Financial Group. I'm your host, Fran Duffy, and today we're going to take a look at new Eagles defensive tackle Hassan Ridgway. I say new. He's actually been here for the last couple of years. And what we've seen from Hassan Ridgway so far with the Eagles defense is that he has been a disruptive player when he's been on the field. He's been injured the last couple of years, so he's missed some time. But whenever he's been out there, he's been a nice key cog of that defensive front. We're going to take a look at what he can do because he's got a very versatile skill set that I remember seeing all the way back in his college days at the University of Texas. Now, we always want to start with his ability to rush the passer. Everybody wants to know how does a guy get after the quarterback. So you're going to see here him just get off the ball. This is prime time against the San Francisco 49ers last year. And you're just going to see that power to win on the outside half against the offensive guard. You can see him kind of win with that bull rush. You see the movement against the offensive lineman. And then you see that late surge. I'll play it full speed so you can really get a sense of his closing burst to the quarterback. Late surge to finish and get the quarterback on the ground. So he brings that disruptive ability against the pass but Hassan Ridgeway also against the run is a really fun player and against or in that old defensive scheme with Jim Schwartz what do we talk about it was always one gap right so you're going to get the defensive lineman get to your landmark get straight up into the backfield and then create some havoc so what you're going to see from Hassan Ridgeway here is that he's going to line up right defensive tackle because again in that old scheme You'd always have a left defensive tackle and a right defensive tackle. They didn't play one technique, three technique. It was always, I'm going to be on the left, you're going to be on the right. And, and Ridgeway had played both spots, but you're going to see here he's lined up what is called a two-eye technique, where you're going to be inside the offensive guard, basically a nose tackle. And he's going to show that first step explosiveness to get into the backfield, watch him beat the guard, and then you see that, that flexibility here at the end, where he's just going to kind of put his foot in the ground right there, one step, flatten out, and get to the running back and get this TFL. Really impressive play here by Hassan Ridgeway. Again, showing off that athleticism, that ability to disrupt in the backfield. But playing against the run is not just about your quickness off the ball. You've got to be able to hold up at the point of attack as well. So what does Hassan Ridgeway look like against double teams? Well, here you're going to see him once again lined up at right defensive tackle, once again as a two-eye technique inside the guard, right? So if he was a little bit further to his left and outside the center, then you would say that's like a one technique as a nose tackle. But since he's just over, we're talking about inches, you call this a two-eye technique. So just a little bit of knowledge there, two-eye technique. So he's lined up inside the guard, and watch, he's going to take on this double team here, and he holds up well. He prevents that double team from getting up to the linebacker level. It's not perfect, but you see the balance there. His ability to hold the point. He gets a little bit high, but watch as he's able to hold his point, stay square, and then still make himself in position to be able to make a play on the running back. Just a couple yard gain there for the Giants on the ground. So nice job there, Hassan Ridgeway, winning at the point of attack against a double team. Now, when you're playing against the run, the other part of this is block recognition, understanding what does the offense like to do in a certain down and distance situation. Here against the Washington football team, you can see the Eagles, they're expecting inside run as you've got a very heavy package here for Washington up front. So the Eagles, they respond accordingly. You've got a very heavy defensive front package with three defensive tackles lined up in what's called a bare front right in the interior of this defensive line. Here's Hassan Ridgeway. He knows the kind of runs they like to use in this down and distance situation. And he's expecting a little bit of a base block here from the center. Watch how quickly he's able to defeat this block. This requires mental processing. This comes from film study. Look how quickly he's able to just swim past, stay square, and then get to the ball carrier right at the line of scrimmage. Basically a no-yard gain there for Washington on the ground. And that all started with Hassan Ridgeway, his ability to recognize that block, defeat it, and then get to the football. And then one last part here with Ridgeway, it's going to be about playing from the backside. That's a little bit of an undertold story when defending the run as a defensive lineman. We know, hey, when things are run your direction, you've got to be able to hold up and make a play. But what happens if it goes the other way? Well, you need to pursue. You need to be there just in case there's a cutback. And I think when you look at Hassan Ridgeway, he's always played with a high motor. He's always showed that urgency from the backside. And you also need some range. Watch him here. He's able to beat the backside cut block of the offensive line. And you just see that range to be able to put himself in position to make this play. So what are we talking about here with Hassan Ridgeway? You've got quickness off the ball, the ability to get after the quarterback. He can defend the run, whether it's point of attack play against a double team, one-on-one -on -one against a base block, or playing from the backside. He's been a very nice rotational piece here for the Eagles defensive front since the Eagles traded for him draft day 2018. 
He's going to continue to do that here this year. Excited to see Hassan Ridgeway in this new defensive scheme. Thanks so much for joining us here on The Film Room, presented by Lincoln Financial Group. I am Fran Duffy. We'll talk to you soon.